Epilepsy is a neurological disorder that affects millions of people worldwide. But what exactly is epilepsy? Epilepsy is characterized by recurrent, unprovoked seizures. These seizures are sudden surges of electrical activity in the brain which can cause a variety of symptoms. The symptoms of epilepsy can vary widely. Some people experience convulsions where they lose consciousness and have uncontrollable muscle movements. Others might have brief lapses in awareness, staring spells or strange sensations. Some individuals may experience auras which are warning signs of an impending seizure. These can include visual disturbances, sensory changes or emotional shifts. Myoclonic seizures involve sudden brief jerks or twitches of the muscles often occurring in clusters. Atonic seizures, also known as drop attacks, cause a sudden loss of muscle tone leading to falls and potential injuries. Tonic-clonic seizures, previously known as grand mal seizures, involve a combination of muscle stiffness and rhythmic jerking, often accompanied by a loss of consciousness. But what causes epilepsy? There isn't always a clear cause. However, some factors can contribute, like genetic predisposition, brain injuries, infections, or developmental disorders. So how do you know if you have epilepsy? If you or someone you know experiences repeated seizures, it's important to see a doctor. Diagnosing epilepsy typically involves a thorough medical history, a neurological exam, and tests like an EEG or brain imaging. Once diagnosed, there are various ways to manage epilepsy. Medication is the most common treatment and helps control seizures in about two-thirds of people with epilepsy. For those who don't respond well to medication, other options include surgery, nerve stimulation, or dietary therapies. The ketogenic diet, a high-fat, low-carbohydrate diet, has been shown to reduce seizures in some individuals, particularly children. Seizure alert devices and wearable technology can also help monitor and manage seizures, providing an added layer of safety. Prevention of epilepsy isn't always possible, but some steps can reduce the risk. Protecting your head to avoid traumatic brain injuries, maintaining good prenatal care to avoid developmental issues, and managing conditions like high fever and infections can help. Living with epilepsy can be challenging, but with the right treatment and support, Many people lead full and active lives. If you think you might have epilepsy or if you have any concerns about your health, don't hesitate to reach out to a healthcare professional. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe for more content like this. Stay informed and stay safe.